Hello everyone. Welcome to Civil Engineering Skills. In this tutorial, I will explain you some basic and simplest method to create a board. Number one is use of offset tool. For example, this is your plot boundary and you want to create boundary walls for this plot area. Activate offset command. Select any edge, drag your mouse and just type your wall thickness. Let's consider that we require 9 inch wall. So just type 9 and hit enter. So here is your offset ready. Now use your push pull command and provide required height. Let's consider we require a height to be 7 feet. So just type 7 feet and here is your boundary wall created. Let's move to our next method that is follow me tool. So with the help of follow me tool, it will be easy to create a boundary wall. For example, if we required 9 inch and 7 feet high wall on each side of this rectangle, for that just create one rectangle of your required size. Let's consider we require a wall thickness to be of 9 inch and height to be of 7 feet. So create one rectangle of 9 inch by 7 feet. And here is your wall has been created. Now select all the edges. Activate follow me command. And just click on your required dimension. And here you can see your wall has been created. So that was the second method. Now we move to the third method. So third method is use of rectangle and push pull command. For example, I require a wall thickness of 9 inch. Then just create a 9 inch rectangle. Okay. Now you can select that rectangle and activate push pull command and provide necessary height. For example, 7 feet. And here you can see your wall is created. Now for the another wall, use a rectangle command and draw a rectangle of 7 feet by 9 inch again use the push pull command and you can create your second wall similarly for the other two edges now the fourth method is create copy of your walls first draw a rectangle of required height for example 9 inch by 7 feet so here you can see your rectangle has created now select that rectangle activate push pull command and start pulling your wall select the junction at which you required another partition wall and hit the control button and again activate your push pull command and you can see one partition has been created in the wall just select the every starting and ending of a junction and hit a control button to create a copy of that wall so from that partition wall you can create another wall so in a similar manner you can construct the wall around your entire 2d drawing okay so that was the fourth method and it will be very much helpful while you are creating your 3D elevation from your AutoCAD file. Last one but not the least, you can use the 1001 bit tool that is a freely available. You can download it from extension warehouse. Just go to windows and extension warehouse and type 1001 bit tool. So from that you can select build vertical wall. When you select that, it will going to ask you about the thickness and wall height. Let's consider we require a thickness of 4 inch and wall height of 7 feet. Okay. Now it will ask you whether you want to align your wall on a left hand side, center or right side. We are considering that to be on right side. So after providing all the information, click on the built wall. Select your first point. Drag your mouse to second, third, fourth and again to first one. Here you can see your wall is created within short period of time. So these are the five simplest methods that you can use as a beginner for your elevation drawing. There are other extensions also available, but I will suggest you should prefer these five methods as a beginner. I hope you like the information provided in this video. If you have any doubt related to any of the contents, you can mention it in a comment. Thank you for watching.